Hello, this is Wobby Wallaby. Let's continue with part 3 of the Hunting Ground buffs. In previous videos, I show how to unlock about two thirds of the buffs available to us right now. So today I'll cover the rest here. The link to those previous videos will be in the description. First, we're looking at Undying Flame 1. I go towards the middle of the map. I check the situation. The floor is on fire, and I go towards the source. I talk with Friedrich, who is pissed off, and his emotions are causing the fire. Eventually, his dad shows up, and he wants us to help his son out. I skip ahead to when I reach the sundial on the left side. Time for more shadow games. For this one, you want the part that is hollowed inward to be facing towards the light source at the top right. I get the clue and continue. I talk with Clinic, who asked me to talk with a young mage. Fjerr asked me to learn flame magic to gain respect. I go back to clinic, but my weak magic isn't enough. I claim my diligence blueprint, and I unlock the magic damage plus 20% map buff. Next, I get ready to do the Undying Flame 2 quest. I talk with Clinic again, and he asks us to do more shadow games. I skip ahead to when I reach the same sundial as always. Get this shape, which looks like two swords clashing together, in the same orientation that I have. For the book, make sure the inward hollow part is facing towards the light source. Go back to clinic, and I skip some of the walking. I get transformed into a guy this time. I go to the top of the map and talk with Wendell. We have to defeat mages. First you'll fight Kino with the world's slowest casting fireball. Next, talk with Sawyer and the correct answer is Sweep Flame. Next is Levin. You need to target the Earth Element. You may want to stand back so your super slow fireball casting doesn't get interrupted.
Once finished, talk with Wendell and get an emblem. I return back to my normal self. I go back to clinic to talk with him. I open the sword monument. I claim my glorious coat of arms blueprint. I unlock the SB regen plus 100% buff. I move into the Undying Flame 3 quest. I talk with Clinic again. Back to the Shadow Games on the top left side. Position the clashing sword shape such that the ends of the sword fills up the bumps of this shape. Next, put the shape such that the inward hollow part is facing away from you and the weird squiggly legs is facing to the right. Slowly adjust it and try not to break your device in frustration. Next, for the book, enlarge it and make the pages face towards you. I get another clue. Talk to clinic again and then he'll ask you to go to the middle right side of the map. A bunch of noble girls are on the bridge wanting to give Nihil a love letter. Go back to clinic after to talk about making beautiful magic. He asks us to show this magic to those noble girls. We have to play a mini game where I click these circles. I give the love letter to clinic. I visit the sword monument and claim my parlor sofa blueprint. I unlock the third field monster draw plus 4% buff. With that, I open the map attribute to show all the buffs available to us. We're still not at the Komodo level of buffs, so farming can still be a challenge here. I'm looking forward to more buffs in the future. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe.